Hello, and welcome to Pokemon TCG Daily Booster Pack 302. Fellow trainers, I hope you've had a fantastic Tuesday wherever you are. Today, we're opening up an XY Ancient Origins Booster Pack and also a Japanese Dragon Majesty Pokemon Booster Pack. So let's go ahead and get started. In case you're brand new to my channel, I've been opening up one Pokemon Booster Pack every single day on this channel now for over 300 days straight. With each and every single video, I like to try and add two QR codes for the online Pokemon training card game. This Booster Pack is giving me a little bit of difficulty opening up, but as I just said, with each and every single video, I like to try and add two QR codes for the online Pokemon training trading card game. The steps to receive a code from me personally are to like this video, subscribe if you're brand new, answer my unique Pokemon question of the day that I include at the end of every single video, and then provide some way that I can get in contact with you personally. This can be via an email account, Instagram, Twitter account. Uh, generally, those are the popular ways. And normally in the past, I've been better at getting them out within a 48 hour uh, time period. This past um, past two weeks or so, I've just been really slammed with work and other Pokemon activities actually, but I'm just trying to get back in the habit of getting those out in a timely manner. But with all that, let's go ahead and get started in this Pokemon booster pack. I want to bring in the focus just a little bit my camera uh we start things off with an um pharaoh spirit link followed by that we have the fairy type pokemon adorable looking curly right there after that, we very appropriate for yesterday's question of the day. We have a special energy that is awesome right there. After that, we follow things up with the fighting type Pokemon Gold Gold Lurk. Uh, we follow things up with the fossil type Pokemon. One of my favorite Pokemon, actually, Relicanth is just an awesome concept, and I think he's actually based off an actual like fossil fish in real life. We follow things up with the fire fairy type Pokemon Cottony. After that, we have an adorable looking Eevee right there, always very popular in the meta. One of my favorite grass type Pokemon, we have an Oddish right there, and we have a really cool looking reverse hollow paint roller that's pretty cool and the last card in the booster pack is the legendary type pokemon reggie rock uh let's go ahead and go on to the special booster packs we've been opening up this week i bought five japanese pokemon booster packs and actually i really didn't buy a whole lot of regionals this time around uh because just because i'm trying to put that money towards going to the anaheim regionals in december where i will be buying more stuff um but let's go ahead and see what we got in this pokemon booster pack like i said i love the japanese pokemon booster packs like i like i um, said in other videos i don't know what the card trick is with these i think it's three from that i think the, uh, the hollows at the back, but let's go ahead and see what we got in this. Uh, we kick things off with, of course, a po very popular water type Pokemon. We have a Lapras right there. After that, we follow things up with, uh, I, I forget, a, Dar uh, a fire type Pokemon dude. I can't speak Japanese, so I actually don't know how, how to say his name. Uh, after that, we have the the ground type Pokemon, Trapinch. We have a go uh, gorgeous looking, I think this is uh, Django Mo. Oh, the final evolution dragon dude. And last uh, but not least, uh, this fire turtle guy, but this is the dragon form of him uh just a really cool looking booster pack the one thing the one thing i i have yet to do from the uh, uh japanese pokemon booster packs is pull like a gx card out and that's kind of one of the things i really hope happens uh, sometime in the near future it'd be really cool to be able to pull a gx uh a pokemon card out of these booster packs but fellow trainers i hope you're having a great day wherever you are like i said things are kind of slowing down not that i'm taking like a week off from pokemon but especially uh playing this past weekend and it's just been really pokemon heavy i'm really just kind of sticking to these videos and trying to revamp the channel and try out hopefully some other things in the near future but fellow trainers out oh, today's question of the day uh, what is your favorite uh, poison type Pokemon down in the comments below? Like I said, this question had nothing to do with um, uh, any of the cards we got today, but I'm kind of doing a theme this week, kind of Pokemon that are on the spookier side, and uh, poison type Pokemon definitely kind of fit that element. Uh, but fellow trainers, I hope you're having a great day wherever you are, and I will talk to you tomorrow as, as always, uh, and happy Halloween or a little bit early.